Grace arrived into the world kicking and screaming and the joy I felt as well as the fear but the joy to hear her um, was just I, n- I will never forget that moment we found out that Grace had health concerns one of the f- things I felt very sore about was th- the idea of not being a family of four and that we were robbed of that opportunity because all we wanted really was to be a family and to have that family unit for ourselves as parents and for our little daughter Katie who really wanted her little sister and it gave us another level of complexity obviously in trying to share with a very innocent beautiful little child the idea that her sister, her little baby sister, wasn't going to be with her forever. Katie adored Grace. Katie was just born to be a big sister. She just always wanted to be a big sister. And when she had news that we were expecting, um, she just couldn't wait to meet the little baby. Although we had told her that Grace had a little sore heart or a weak heart, um, she never in any way doubted. And nor did we that we would get to meet her. When Katie met her for the first time, Katie said she's the most beautiful little girl I've ever seen. (laughs) So it was special to see her and to feel her connect with her little baby sister. For Katie to see her and feel her and touch her little hands was just beautiful. There's a very special bond between Katie and Grace. Before Grace was born um, for the Christmas, um, Katie bought Grace Tiny, her little teddy, And then Katie got a little gift from Grace of a little penguin. (laughs) The moments that Katie held Grace, only for being in Laura Lynn, we would never have had that presence. And the peace and the, the, the situation that was created from that peace to allow that to happen. Because I was obviously very filled with fear. And when I was in the comfort of Laura Lynn, I felt I could allow Katie that time to nurse her little sister, to be present with her little sister and to feel that connection. Laura Lynn offered us a beautiful home for the time that we were present and it was it was our home and it was fun and we had the time and the comfort to be together as a family unit and enjoy activities and feel that we were united together and in a very comfortable, cared for environment where I had, as Grace's mother, the support and the understanding and the the care that I needed for Grace and for myself and for Katie. And all of the practical concerns of life were taken away. Um, we didn't have to worry about anything apart from being together and making those memories and having quality time as a little family unit. They offered Katie great um, great support, great fun activities, arts and crafts and music and um, she could play in the playground and they organised little days out for her as well which allowed me to know that she was taken care of, she was very happy and I also had that one-on-one time with Grace as well. I didn't even need to say what I needed, they already knew. A big um, part of that was knowing that um, Katie was happy and that Katie and Grace had time to bond together and they'd done little pieces of artwork together, you know, and those little things just would never have happened without the care and the love and the opportunity that being in Laura Lynn provided us. We would never have brought Grace home and taken beautiful photographs and we would never have had the opportunity for four of us to sit together and capture a photograph and a memory that stays with us. Jenny, with Laura Lynn, got the most beautiful photograph with Grace's eyes wide open as Katie looked down at Grace. And you can feel, from a photograph, you can feel the connection between the two sisters. A very pure love is what I would describe it as, and a sisterly bond. We look back at our time in Laura Lynn with the most fond memories because it was a very, very happy time where we feel we lived the fullest life that we could together. We were a family of four for those pre- that precious moment in time. You don't realise how precious a moment is until it is a memory and it's all you have.